everybody, this is Bethany from Sue Say Steve. Today we are reviewing this great little sandwich maker. Um, this one is really great. Um, it's just a regular sandwich maker, um, as you can see. Um, but, um, so it clips here to hold it shut. Um, but what I love about this one is that it has these different plates that you can plug into it to do different things. So this is just a grill one, which you can actually even do meat on. Um, but you can just pop these out, um, just push these buttons, and they just, um, right here, slide them, and they just pop right out. And then if I want to put in, you know, the traditional one with the squares, um, you just um, fasten them in and press it down. So it's that easy. Um, and it also comes with... My personal favorite, the waffle, waffle one. So, uh, so this is a waffle maker too. Um, but yeah, you can just pop that in and press it down. You get two of each, so you do one on the top and one on the bottom. Um, we are going to make a sandwich to show you um, how it works. Um, so we're going to get this heated up, and we'll be right back. This is Bethany from Sue Say Steve. Now you can see the green light has indicated that it is hot and ready. So we're going to put a grilled cheese in here. We're just doing the grill one because we don't like the little triangle shapes. So we just do the plain grill. Um, but you'll push it down and then clip it so that it stays shut and let it cook. Um, it doesn't take very long really. Um, and it is ready to go. It gets really hot though, so be really careful um, when you are using it because you don't want to burn yourself. Um, and then you can, I would have let it cook a little bit longer, but um, I think that this should light up, the other half of it should light up. Uh, after it's cooked. Um, but anyway, it's pretty easy to use. Like I said, you can also put in the little sectioned off plates or waffles. Um, so I like to use it as a waffle maker as well. So, um, but it's really easy to use and uh, user friendly. I will say that the directions, the user manual wasn't really written. I mean, it's written in English, but it's not really easy to read. Kind of like broken English, so but it runs kind of like a traditional um, sandwich maker, so um, so it's pretty functional and easy to figure out. But see, so you can see the light turned off, so it should be ready there, um, and you can just pull it off, and it's good to go, perfect, um, not burnt or anything. Um, like I said, you can do meat on the grill thing too, so. This is a really versatile one. You can check out my full review and more information in the comments of this video.